The number one question that I get from family members, friends, and students is what's your best advice to get rich quick? Over the years, I've had to answer this question time and time again. Today on Coffee with Dr. A, I'll tell you what my advice is on how to get rich quick. If you're new here, I'm Dr. Abdullah Abrani. I created this channel to increase understanding of economics. I strive to help people make better decisions by building a better foundation of economic knowledge. So grab a cup of coffee and let's talk about how to get rich quick. My brother has the best response to this question. He always says, easy come, easy go. The get rich quick question assumes that there is a magical pill that can provide you with the ability to make money overnight. When it comes to making money, the long game and consistent game is the only advice that I would give. There are three ways to make money. Let's break them down. First is luck. And this is what the social media financial gurus try to convince you to look into. Buy this stock, invest in this opportunity, and you'll become rich and they base their statements on an example of luck. This reminds me of the lose weight quick advice that you find in advertising. Be wary of this advice. In fact, run away. Remember, my brother says, easy come, easy go. The second is leveraging your capital. The other way to making large sums of money is investing large sums of money. Making 3% on $100 means you make $3. Making 3% on $100 million means you've made $3 million. So if someone is telling you about how much money they have made, ask them how much their investment was. If you do not have large sums of money to invest, then you will love tip number three. Tip number three, leverage compound interest. This is by far my favorite method of getting rich, but it isn't going to be quick. Let us talk about compound interest or compound growth. The example I give to my students is I ask them the following hypothetical situation. Would you rather receive $50,000 a day for the next 30 days or receive a penny, one cent today that doubles in value every day for the next 30 days? If you're like my students, you've already pulled out a piece of paper and started calculating and you will probably calculate growth of the penny till the 12th day where you'll stop and say, option A, receiving $50,000 a day is by far more valuable, but you're wrong. What you are overlooking is the idea of compound growth or exponential growth. The $50,000 a day will accumulate to equal to $1.5 million after 30 days. That's a lot of money, but it isn't even close to compound growth of a penny that doubles in value every day. After 30 days, that penny will be worth $5.3 million. I do understand that 100% daily returns is an exaggerated example, but it proves a point. Think about consistent long run returns to build your wealth. It also means that earlier you start, the better. There's no perfect time to start. There is now, or later. So get started today, even if it's putting a penny away. In the comments, tell me honestly, if you pick the $50,000 or the penny before I gave the answer. If you found this information helpful, like, subscribe, share it with someone who you think would benefit from this information. See you next week on Coffee with Dr. A.